Sorry, got distracted there. The case fell over and <laughs> freaked me out. I'm like, what's falling? What's happening? What guitar is getting hurt? But, um, so what are we doing today? So look, look at this thing, a stick with strings. <laughs> and um, basically I reviewed the original Any Gig two or three years ago now, I think. And uh, you guys really, I mean, the video got like, you know, I think 300,000 views, like a crazy amount of views. And I was like, okay, so when the new one came out, I was like, hey guys, can I review that guitar again? So this is their new version of uh, the tra the Any Gig Travel Guitar. This is their A-G-E-S-E -E version. Now, I dig it because it is extremely stripped down and bare bones. Um, like I said, I've had mine for a few years, haven't had any issues with it, but they kind of updated a few things that I think just a lot of people thought could be better. You know, uh, one of the big things was it, the original one didn't have a strap button on it. If you see that right there, it uh, basically it had tuners sticking out here and I'll show you the original. You can see how the tuners kind of stuck out here. And basically you put your strap on this and I think it worried a lot of people that it would go out of tune. And uh, I personally didn't have, you know, many issues with that, you know, going out of tune because it kind of sits right here, but they still felt the need to address it. They moved the tuning pegs around, added that and, uh, I think it, you know, overall, it just made it an, an even more sound guitar. And uh, like I said, it's it's so simple, you know, there's not a lot to do. One of the big concerns I had when I got it was I got it and the action was super high. And I was like, dang, you know, this is not the way the other one was. But what I didn't realize is, uh, well, I knew this, the guitar is a normal scale length, 25 and a half inch guitar, but you have a truss rod right here and you can adjust, it has a tunematic bridge. So I just lowered the bridge a little bit, adjusted the neck, and then I was. All set. So it is, uh, you know, I already thought it was a good, you know, good kind of buy and all that stuff, but they've, they've definitely made it even better. Now, uh, what I, one of the things I wanna talk about is this pickup. Now there's no volume knob on this guitar at all. It's just kind of like straight up, you plug in and you rock, and that's your only option. And uh, I cannot believe how good this pickup, you know, you, I, to me, if I saw a guitar like this, I would expect the pickup to be absolute garbage. And whatever they've done to these pickups, the other one was the same way. They're so good. They, I mean, it sounds... <laughs> I'm plugged into my Axe Effects right now. It does mess with me not having any knobs because I'm used to just kind of switching back, but you know, to be able to travel with an actual full, full length guitar and um, with the strap on, you know, this thing sits very, very comfortably. It's very balanced, you know? I mean, it, it just kind of like stays wherever you put it. And especially with that strap button, I think it puts it in a little bit of a better spot. You got a little arm that if you take it apart you can kind of put the arm put put the arm away and then you put it up here and you plug it in but I'm pretty pumped up about this thing it just sustains for days um, no that is a pedal that I'm using but it'd be sweet if the guitar did that too uh, you know, like I said, it, it's very simple. It's a rosewood fingerboard. Uh, surprisingly, the fret work is, is good. You know, again, I figured there'd be some sharp edges on it and stuff, but it's totally fine. It's, it's a three piece maple body on here. So it's, a uh, it's pretty sturdy. <laughs> Why? 
guitar tuning. <laughs> I'm telling you what, man. This is this is the travel guitar. Now I know in the other videos, some people uh, were commenting. It was like, oh, well, I could just buy a cheap used guitar, you know, uh, instead of you know one of these tiny little travel guitars. I'm like, you could, and that kind of defeats the whole purpose of traveling with it because you're gonna have all the same issues. If you're getting on a plane or something like that, don't risk breaking a full guitar or having to pay extra to check a bag or something like that. Uh, my buddy Trey over at Gear Gods did a really good video where he traveled with his. He, he got an any gig and he traveled and went from uh, California all the way, I believe, to Jersey. And uh, had no issues. It fits right in the overhead bin. No one says anything about it. And um, I think they're fantastic for that. <laughs> One thing I have not had to do on either of these, because um, I mean, when I'm not traveling, I don't don't you know sit around and play these guitars. I play my other guitars, but I've never had to change the strings on them. So I would be a little bit curious about that. But like I said, I, I don't think that this is. I mean, if you're buying this guitar to travel with, it's not going to be a guitar that gets heavy play. So strings are going to last you know forever on this thing. That they've been on the other one uh, for a couple years, like I said. Um, but yeah, other than that, you know, I can't really see too many issues with, issues with this thing. I like that, you know, I, I, I would imagine to keep costs down to where they can have them priced the way that they are. That's why there's no volume knob. That's why there's not a second pickup, stuff like that. I think they really just chose, like, the most important factors. Get a really good sounding pickup in here. Uh, you know, have an actual full scale length guitar neck, which I think is, is really crucial. For someone like me who mainly plays strats and stuff like that, 25 and a half. It's really where I feel the most comfortable um, with this app. <laughs> Alrighty guys, that is going to be it. This is the AnyGig A-G-E-S-E, -E, the new upgraded version, and uh, just like the last one, it seems solid, and you know what? I dig it. So, if you want to check it out more, you, there's links down below, but other than that, uh, I guess I'm going to go play a guitar out in the snow or something. Who, no, I'm, I'm not going to do that, actually. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> I'm going to sit right here and play guitar, that's why. I... <laughs>